All right, there's nothing like being able to say, look at me now. After a tough breakup, even Hollywood hotties seek revenge after love is gone through the best way they know how, a killer makeover. Reese Witherspoon may have kicked husband Ryan Phillippe to the curb after rumors that he cheated, but she didn't wallow with the box of bonbons. Instead, she grabbed another Hollywood hunk. She's with Jake Gyllenhaal. You know, she's definitely upped her game. She's looking amazing, better than ever, and she's really showing that, you know what, there is a uh, life after a divorce. I think she looks sexier now. She was a little more reserved before. After her divorce with Nick Lachey, Jessica Simpson rebounded with a new man and a new look. But it didn't necessarily suit the blonde-haired beauty. With her other rebound relationship with John Mayer, you know, you saw almost like a groupie kind of girl, you know, uh, baggy jeans, bandanas, dark brown hair. I think Jessica Simpson looks a lot less sloppy after she broke up because now she has to try to find a new man. Justin Timberlake must have cried her a river when he saw Cameron Diaz looking better than ever after their breakup. It was almost like she was playing down her looks while she was with Justin Timberlake. You know, always wearing jeans, kind of a surfer chic look. But now, all of a sudden, she's really showing off those amazing legs that she has. You know? They married after meeting on the set of Brokeback Mountain. But only two years after their I do's, Michelle Williams and Heath Ledger said, maybe I don't after all. You know, look at her now. I mean, she's a, she has this pixie haircut. She um, is beautiful and stunning. But before that, um, you know, she looked very much the mom, very much like a bohemian uh, Brooklynite. Ellen Barkin made her big screen comeback in Ocean's 13 and proved that divorcing a billionaire could spark a revenge makeover that's priceless. She's over 50, and she's, you know, giving shame to the women in their 30s. And while she was married to Ron Perlman, she said, you know what, I felt like I had to put my career aside. You know, it didn't really work for me to be on a movie set. He didn't like that. All right.